Catherine Faith prayer call. Heavenly Father, we invite you in on tonight. We ask you to have free course and move by your spirit on tonight. Every hindrance we call out in the name of Jesus. Every stronghold we call out in the name of Jesus. Every distraction we call out in the name of Jesus. We ask for clear airways on tonight, Lord God. We thank you tonight, Lord God, for every participant that is on the line, Lord God. We thank you for everyone that is streaming with us tonight on social media. We welcome you in on Sisters with Conquering Faith Prayer Line tonight, Lord God. We say, have thine own way and move by your spirit, Father God. We call out tonight, Lord God every principality of darkness, Lord God, that's trying to come up in on the people, Lord God. We call out, Lord God, every procrastination spirit, Lord God, that is causing us to move not in our vision, Lord God, that's causing our dreams to be hindered, Lord God. So we call those things out, Lord God, as you lead us to a new chapter in our lives, Lord God, for the new doors that you're opening for us on tonight, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for moving by your spirit on today, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for giving us the list and the vision and the plan that you have set before us, Lord God, that is not our will, but it's your will that's going to get accomplished tonight, Lord God. So we thank you, Lord God, for coming in on tonight, Lord God. We thank you for pulling down the strongholds of principalities, Lord God, that's causing us to have fog vision, Lord God, that's trying to mess with our mental state, Lord God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for dwelling in our mind. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for touching our hearts on tonight, Lord God. We thank you for liberty. We thank you for the activity of our limbs on tonight, Lord God. God. We thank you for blessing this day, Lord God. We thank you for prosperity, Lord God. We thank you for increase, Lord God. We thank you for our family, Lord God. We thank you that you have provided for them, Lord God. We thank you for the shelter, Lord God. We thank you for just the simplest things that you have provided for us on this day, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for moving on our behalf on today, Lord God. We thank you for blocking everything that the enemy tried to come up against us on this day, Lord God. We thank you for pulling down, Lord God, Whatever it was that the enemy was trying to bring home on us, Lord God, that you shift in the atmosphere and you sent your angels to cover us, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for that, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, for new avenues, Lord God. We thank you for the dimension of double doors that's opening before us tonight, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, that there's liberty in the house, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, that never before, that we're about to walk into our eyes has not seen situation, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, that you're about to move on our behalf and it's going to blow our minds, Lord God. We thank you for moving. Fear out of the way. We thank you for moving doubt out of the way. We thank you for increasing our faith on tonight, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, that our faith is going from level to level, that we're beginning to believe in ourselves in a different way, Lord God, that you have been building up our confidence, Lord God, that we can become the Christian entrepreneur that you have called us to be, that we become the boss women and boss men that you have called us to be in the kingdom, Lord God. You have called us to walk in a leadership anointed in this season, Lord God. You have called us to come up out of the four walls and to begin to evangelize, Lord God, whether it's in the schoolhouse, whether it's on our job, whether it's in the grocery store, in the hospital, Lord God. You have called us to do something that we thought we could not do. You're calling us out in this hour. You keep on telling us that we have the power within us to do these things, Lord God. And we thank you, Lord Jesus, for calling us out on tonight, Lord God. We thank you for moving us out of our comfort zone, Lord God, because we had gotten complacent. We had gotten into a situation where we were comfortable, Lord God. We thank you for shifting us in the spirit realm, Lord God. We thank you for putting a new hunger in us. We thank you for putting a new desire in us, Lord God. There's a new will in us, Lord God that we see ourselves different, Lord God. When we look in the mirror, we see a changed person. When we look in the mirror, we see the anointing of God shining upon us. We see the light within us shining back. We see the difference, Lord God, that we no longer stay in that humble state of mind and we're no longer in that situation where we think we couldn't do it because our increase in faith, our increase in ability. So we thank you tonight, Lord God, for your supernatural strength that is filling us up. We thank you, Lord God, for that. We 
E candela basi God. E candela basi rero boko sata. We thank you for the start over anointing. We thank you for the fresh anointing, Lord God, that is falling upon us tonight, God. We thank you for moving the disbelief, God, out our spirit. O rabasi candela basi koto bo shanda. E candela boko si rero boko sanda. E candela ba ba basi rero boko robo shaka. We thank you, Lord God, for the second chance anointing. When we thought we couldn't do it. But your faith stepped in. Your will stepped in. Your power stepped in. And you gave us a new joy. You gave us a new happiness, God. You gave us a new motivation, God. So we thank you tonight, God, for the power to inspire through the Holy Spirit. We thank you, Lord God, that we can shift the atmosphere. And that our sorrow can become joy. We thank you for that, Lord God, that we can pick up the fruits of the Spirit. Oh God, I thank you tonight, God, for your joy, for your peace, for your happiness, for the love that you have given us that surpasses all understanding, God. We thank you that the love conquers all, Lord God. We thank you for that gift, Lord God. That love can cast out hate in this hour, Lord God. So if there's any hatred in our heart tonight, God, oh, ba, 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 see, God, we ask you to cleanse it. We ask you to purge our hearts on tonight, Lord God. Purge it with hyssop, Lord God, so that we know that it's going to be clean, God. We thank you, Lord God, that as you begin to work on our heart, you begin to build up new relationships. You begin to strengthen the old relationships, God. We thank you, Lord God, for moving those out our way that you didn't want in our path. We thank you for breaking the stronghold of people that once was on our mind, God, in our hearts and was being crutches to us, Lord God. We thank you, Lord God, that we release the crutch on tonight, Lord God, so that we can walk in the will that you are calling us to walk in, God, because you said that by your word, you have new people that we have not yet even met. There's people that's anointed that's appointed with a vision that we have to help us go to the next level, God. So we don't want to hold on to the old God because we want to see the new that you have for us in this hour, God. We want to walk into the new destiny. We want to walk into the new dimension. We're not going to let it hold us down in this season, God. For we break in every yoke of bondage that keep on trying to come up against us. They keep on trying to pull us down. Every time you lift us up, something keep pulling us down. We cancel out broken cycles on tonight, God. We cancel out the ring around circles, God. That things begin to come up. And pull us down in our spirit, God. We call that out tonight, God. We're not going to allow that to hinder us in this dispensation. We're going to walk into this last quarter with a fresh start and a new mindset that no weapon formed against us shall prosper because the blood of Jesus is cleansing us. The blood of Jesus is drawing us, but there's a new hunger and thirst inside of us. Glory to the Lamb of God. Thank you tonight, God. I thank you, Lord God. I feel your presence, God. I thank you tonight, God. Ooh, Jesus, I thank you tonight, God. I thank you tonight, God. Ah, my God, my God. I hear it in the spirit realm. That God's been dealing with you. This morning I came on because it was in my spirit. And God began to tell me to do something that he gave me to do. To do something that God has given us on our vision board. God has given us a plan. He's told us some dreams. He's given us some visions. He's asked us to do some things to bring glory to his name. And for some reason, 
we all get on this level of procrastination and we just put it to the side. Oh, ba 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 see God. So God is saying today to pick it back up. Oh, ba 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 see Pick up every dream, pick up every vision, pick up every plan. Oh, ba 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 see And begin to revamp it. Oh, ba 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 sata rebo shata. Begin to take something off of that list. Oh, come ma see kata tatara. And start accomplishing it, checking it off. Oh, ba 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 see here the rebo kosata. Our beginning may have started slow. We may have been lacking in the beginning. But we're going to finish this year out stronger than we ever finished it out before. Because we got a new drive inside of us. And somebody got a book that they need to begin to work on. God said it's time for you to release the book. Because the book that I got in store for you. It's going to break some strongholds. It's going to lose some people. You have a testimony that's going to help save somebody's life. So it's time for you to pick up what God gave you. So you can finish this year off strong. Hey God, He said, I'm gonna do something. That you thought couldn't happen for you. He said, I'm beginning to move some things around in your life. He said, I'm beginning to shift some things. And when you think you're lost, when you think you're alone, he said, understand that I'm there with you. I'm just moving the things out of your way. That was not meant to be in your life. But you kept holding on to him. He said, now this is the time. This is the time that you let it go. So not only will you see my hand at work, but you'll feel my presence moving. And all you're going to be able to say is, oh, Jesus did it for me. This is a God did it move. He said, man has nothing to do with it in this hour. Just continue to draw in my presence. Just continue to seek my face. And watch how I'm going to do it for you. He said, I'm about to seal some deals. I'm about to open new doors. I keep hearing the wells are beginning to open. The financial wells are coming. There's a breaking in the ground. For the wells are springing forth. Because the atmosphere is shifting. The blessings are coming. The harvest is coming. It's time for you to reap every seed that you have sown on good ground. Yes, God, a pressed down, shaken together blessing is about to overtake you in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus, for a new way of living on tonight. We thank you tonight, God. For a new prayer life. We thank you for awakening the gift up inside of us tonight, God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the blood covering. 
Ekandalabasi, God. We thank you for sealing the blood upon us, God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, that every day, we wake up, we wake up in a new expectancy. Every time we get ready to go to bed, God, a greater dream, a greater expectancy leaps in our spirit at night, God. Ekandalabasi, we thank you tonight, God. For the anointing that destroys every yoke of bondage, that destroys every oh, stronghold, every shackle, God. Robo we thank you, Lord Jesus. That there shall be no more depression, no more anxiety. It can't take over the believers. Because we got purpose. We got destiny calling us. We thank you for a new direction, God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, that we're not looking back, but we're looking forward. We're looking to the hills which our help coming from. And we know that our help is coming from the Lord. Because we trust and we hope in the Lord. We depend upon the Lord. We thank you tonight, God. We thank you, God. For the contagious anointing. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the joy, the laughter. Is it beginning to fill our homes again, God? We thank you for your omnipresence, God. We thank you that Jehovah Shammah keeps coming in the room. We thank you for inviting him in. We thank you for great and mighty things that you're going to do with us tonight, God. See God, that this is just the start of a new beginning. Oh, Rabba Baba Basi Kotoboko Sandra Labaha, E Katana Bashandare Rosso Torobo, E Kandala Basi Katara Eko Shandaraha. We thank you tonight, God, E Kandare Loboko Sandare Rebo Shata. Ah, that your spirit is having its way in our homes tonight, God. We thank you for moving in our prayer closet on tonight, God. We thank you for the altar, God. Oh, ba 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 shandri le le robo. I katata na mama ma sikete. Robo bo bo shandri le ke sata. We thank you, God. Robo bo si yere le le ba ha yere robo ko sata. E kanda le ba si yere le le robo ko shandri e sata. That the distraction. Oh, ra ba 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 si kanda le la sata. E kanda le le ba kasi ko robo ko shanda. Can't move you from the course. Can't move you from the plan of action that God has you on. Stay focused. Don't waver in your faith. Keep on walking forward. Keep on believing. Keep on receiving that God is doing it. Help me, God, to remove the unbelief that surround me, God, so that I can do what is required of me, God. What is required of you in this hour. We thank you, Lord God, for moving mightily on our behalf, God. We thank you, Lord. We thank you, Lord. 
We thank you tonight, oh Rabba God, for all that you've done for us, oh Rabba God. We thank you, Lord God, we exalt you, oh Rabba Sigata. We glorify you, we magnify you, ha ba 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 ha, oh Rabba ba Siga, robo bo shata tata na ba Siga. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the fresh and the new mantle, God, oh ko mama Sika ndere lebo ko sata that you have placed upon our lives, oh Rabba Sika ndere lebo ko shandere le kasata. We thank you for the yes that's in our spirit. Yes, we'll go. Yes, we'll do it. No matter what it costs. We'll still say yes, God. Because we know that it's just for a moment. That every storm has an end. Every bad day has a new beginning. Increase our dominion and authority that is within us so that we can speak to the atmosphere and change the atmosphere so that we can move the winds and the waves. Fall, call down on the fire of the Holy Ghost. Call down on the winds. You have the power within you to do it. You have the power to draw. You have the power that when you walk into the room, you can change the atmosphere. Because he's given you the authority, the dominion to do so. For we anoint our head. We begin to anoint our ear gates. So we don't hear anything. That is not in the will of God for our lives. For our words are anointed. To bring forth blessings. To bring forth prosperity. To bring forth fruit. To bring forth fruit. We thank you tonight, God. We thank you tonight for coming in. We thank you tonight for answered prayers, God. We thank you for the covering over our family. We thank you for the covering over those that's connected to us by divine assignment, God. We thank you for sharpening the gift of the seekers in the spirit. We thank you for allowing us to guard our spirit in this dispensation. So nobody can use the gift that God has given us. And we shall not give our gifts. No our pearls to the swines. Sharpen our discernment tonight, God. So we can see the hearts of the people that we come in contact with, God. But we're going to try the spirit by the spirit. And if the spirit is not for us, show us how to walk away, God. We thank you tonight, God, for every good deed. We thank you for the seeds that we sow, God. Seeds of confidence, seeds of faith, God. Seeds of inspiration, seeds of empowerment, seeds of encouragement. We thank you tonight, God, for coming and sitting in the room with us tonight, God. We thank you tonight, God. But being El Shaddai, 
We thank you tonight for being Jehovah Rapha to somebody. We thank you tonight for being Jehovah Tiskanu. We thank you for being Jehovah Raha. We always thanking you for being Jehovah Jaro. We thank you. Because when we open the doors of our heart, you come on in the room with us. So we thank you, Jehovah Shama. For being here with us. Oh, come, Mama see God. We thank you that you are the great I am. We thank you for being great and mighty. We thank you. For allowing us to know that we are the seeds. Of our forefathers. That we are the blessed seeds. We are the seeds of royalty. We are the heirs of the wealth and the riches from our father we thank you again God for the wells that's opening up in our name we thank you Lord Jesus that you're going to teach us how to invest not just in our personal in our lives, but in the kingdom. So seeds into those that surround us lives, God. We thank you for a missionary anointing, God. We thank you for the return on our seeds that we plant, God. Whether it's through time, whether it's through deed, whether it's through word, God. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for allowing us to be the vessel that can deposit into somebody else's life. We thank you, Lord Jesus, for the strength that we stand upon. We thank you for the courageous anointing. We thank you for the Joshua. Be strong. Because it takes strength. To minister to somebody. So we thank you, Lord Jesus, for the people that you allow to come in our path. That they have receptive spirits. That they have a receptive heart. So we thank you tonight, God, for your presence again. We thank you for your love, God. We thank you for your peace, God. We thank you that you're going to be our keeper as we begin. You're going to keep us as we start this new journey. We thank you, Lord Jesus. Though the vision tarry. But we thank you for a fresh wind. That's causing us to start all over again. But we got back up again, God. We're beginning to write again, God. We're beginning to pull the tools out, God. That you told us to pull out. So we can birth the next vision, God. So we can release the next dream that you have for us, God. So we thank you tonight for calling in. We thank you for joining us on social media tonight. May the blessings of the Lord be with you. Good night.